guys welcome to 400 media so today i am not in a car i'm not walking or wandering somewhere around i'm sitting on my behind because it's extremely hot today as you can see i'm sitting in the shade and i have this beautiful uh 2017 polo c6 tsi behind me um this is a car we will be doing today or we are doing a review on today um it's not a performance car or anything like that it's more of a stance type car um so yeah also i would like to thank each and everyone for entering the bmw e30 competition um unfortunately we've been having some technical problems um the video of makes doing the draw um for the winner of the e30 um that video got corrupted and i could not edit or even upload the video um but marlon um i've already contacted him marlon won the competition that is a 1991 bmw 380i mex um so yeah i did get in contact with marlon and he will be getting his t-shirt his 400 meter stickers and the bucket of king shine i'm just waiting on the printing guys to let me know when the stuff's ready so yeah thank you to each and everyone that entered i really appreciate it and thank you to each and everyone that has supported us um i know the uploads haven't been consistent but we will be doing or trying our best to upload videos consistently in the future um, starting with this beautiful TSI behind me. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the videos. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below what you guys would like to see. Um, tomorrow, if everything goes well today, tomorrow I'll be doing a car that quite a few people have been requesting. Not a certain car, but a type of car. Um, so yeah, look forward to that. And yeah, thank you guys. Safe. Yo guys, so you join me inside the car with Venus. Uh, we were actually going to do the interview on the outside because it's so hot today, but unfortunately we aren't able to. Mr. Venus, hey man. All right, what's up? No complaints, no complaints. Mr. Venus, thank you for the opportunity to do your polo. Yes, of course. Um, tell me, tell me about your polo. What are we sitting in today? Uh, it's basically a 2017 model Polo TSI Highline. Okay. 1.2 full cylinder. Um, 2017, no? 2017 yeah. the highline obviously it means it comes with a panoramic sunroof yes. and like controls windows, yes. on the steering and all of that cruise control and yeah all of that but it means scooters yes <laughs> <laughs> um so how long do you have the car now uh, i have the car for about two years and four months now okay um, uh, two years and four months isn't okay it's a decent amount of time did you get the car standard yes uh i basically just lowered the car okay uh, installed some coilovers. What coilovers are you running on? Uh, the ARCs. Okay. And uh, basically, I just added the Batman wing. Okay, they didn't come with mudguards. Add the mudguards and the front lip. Okay, because I saw the auto style stickers on the car, so I must have known. Yes, the accessories came from auto style. The accessories came from auto style. Okay, because I believe the car had a big auto style sticker on the windscreen as well at some point. Yes, I had auto style on the windscreen, auto style sticker. But then the windscreen got smissed and. Yeah, the change of the windscreen, I didn't get time to do the stickers yet. Okay, okay. Are oh, you repping auto style? Yes, I'm currently repping auto style. Okay, okay. Um, my, my, now my question to you is, so why did you decide to buy a Polo? Uh, actually, the dream was a Rannix. Still a Rannix RSI. Uh, but, I went to, but when I went to view the Polo, I just fell in love with the car. The comfort it gives and, I mean, reliability sake. Um, I've been in the car scene for about a few years and... You get fed up for, from time and time after time going through some same shit. Yeah, for unreliability. Unreliability. Okay, he also has a Navara with a Lexus V8, which we'll also be doing and coming to the channel. Um, but you, you you spoke about the dream being RXI, Ranex. Yes. Um, but then you saw this car. But I think most, peop most times when people see these cars, especially with the sunroof. Like my cousin, I asked her, How come it's a polo coupe? Sunroof. <laughs> yeah, no other, no other, nothing else. Sunroof. Yes, it just completes the look, man. Yeah, I guess so. I guess, so. and especially um, with auto style, especially you see, you see other guys mod the car and how it can look once yes. it's done with just a few touches here and there, like mud flaps, yes. the front diffuser or lip, and then just lowering the car. Now my question to you is: Are we going air suspension? Uh, that's the plan. But as soon as we find instantly stable to do it, we'll do it. Okay, so definitely A. Yes. Um, you said you installed sound. Yes. What sound? Um, I'm currently having a four-channel, seven thousand watt energy audio amp. 
Okay. With uh, I think it's a 1,200 watt DVC Pioneer Champion Series up. Okay. And then with the standard deck and the uh, factory footed mids in the doors. Okay, so everything except for the, the, the amp and the sub is standard still? Yes, so. still Victor. Okay, um, I saw there's an iTex icon at the back as well. Yes. What did Mr. Lucky sort you out with? Uh, we initially took out the middle box. Okay. And the standard back box, so we're running one box. Uh -huh. I think it's a 63 mil back box, a power flow box, stainless steel box we put on. Okay. So that's what iTex did for me. Okay, I'm glad you didn't opt for the pops and bangs map, but we spoke about it that <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so you do plan on modding the car, making it more fun for you? Yes, um, I was actually thinking software, maybe like a downpipe, mm -hmm. but all in due time, because as you know. Surprisingly, these cars sound actually very fun with um, software and downpipe, and, yeah. and you actually can hear them spooling. Yeah. So I was actually impressed when I heard a friend of mine has a TSI that all this engine stuff he's not a person for looks it's just engine stuff yeah. so you, when he comes on you actually hear the car dumping and i didn't expect that from a tsi i mean it's such a small turbo yeah um okay so you are planning on putting in air you are planning on doing on mods how long do you still think you're going to keep the car uh, as the dream is for a Ranex rxi i don't know the car was sold it was sold initially it was with new owners for two months but is that the time the car just disappeared? Yes, that was the time. Okay, okay, okay. And then every time I saw the, I saw the car, my heart skipped a beat. And it just keep on looking more beautiful every time I saw it. And you wanted it back? Yeah, and I decided, no man, let's support these people again. <laughs> Luckily for me, I managed to get it back. Okay, okay, lucky for you, no? Yeah. Mr. Benas, thank you very much for the opportunity again. And I look forward to doing the review with you and your Lexus powered Navara. Um, Surely. I will be uploading a video of a certain someone doing a certain illegal thing on a certain illegal spot um, <laughs> with the, the, the Bucky so you guys can have a teaser or a taste on what's to come to the channel um, yeah today's a very busy day for us so we guys will be filling you guys in with content I hope you guys enjoy the video don't forget to like share subscribe comment down below what you guys would like to see uh, I'd like to thank you Sergio and thank you for the opportunity for 100 media. Uh, you guys rock. Thank you very much. It's just a pleasure. Thank you guys. Hope you enjoy. Safe. Safe guys. Plans? Oh, is this beer, Ja, nou, jelle gaat